MK808Z as well as the MK808ZBT, which I'll do a quick comparison on. I also shared on the right. As you can tell, you have the HDMI port for connecting to external displays. On the rear of both devices, you have the regular kickstand for to be seen if the improved hardware, especially the car and powering up the devices, you begin to appreciate the new feel that Android 11 brings to these tools. The main screens are identical, except that on the Bluetooth version, because of the VCI dongle, you have the VCI manager. Swiping over to the left, and you can see that they both come with the Maxi Video app out of the box. On the regular MK808, you need to download the massive update that Autel did on these tools to get this app. This means that you can now connect Autel's MV108 Borescope camera to any of these devices. I reviewed the Borescope camera two weeks ago, and you can catch that video if you want more details on this. I also leave some links in the description to the bundle for the scanner and the Borescope, which enables you to get the Borescope at around $20 instead of $49 as at the time of making this video. The other difference between these two devices is that on the Bluetooth version, you're able to UT506 is a Bluetooth device and only connects to the scanner version on the right may be more appealing to you. The other thing which is a common feature of both tools that I want to highlight is access to the secure gateway module apps are also available on the 37 service functions. Of course, access is dependent on the car you're in. The rest of the apps are the same between the two scanners as well as the regular 808 series. Since these two devices are the same, I'll just continue on the MK808Z and head over to Diagnostics for some tests. I'll just select Auto Detect and basically select the rest of the parameters for this car which is a 2017 Accord. I'll go ahead and scan all modules. In real time, the whole process took about 2 minutes 19 seconds, no fault codes. My Maxi Pro usually takes about 2 minutes 46 seconds, but again this is a wired connection and it may just be down to the elimination of Bluetooth latency through this wired connection. The other thing I'd like to show is that both of these tools, as well as the regular 808 series, now have access to active tests. And for this car, I'm getting exactly the same number of active tests that I get on my MP808TS. And maybe just demonstrate a test, select door locks, I go into active tests and click 